What's up, Faith family? Uh, we're back again with another review of the Hot Wheels Prototype H24. Um, and this particular model was released in 2008. Um, I'm not entirely clear on how I came into possession of this. I mean, I got most of these a long time ago. I barely remember them. And uh, as you can see, of course, it's dirty because I don't like to put these things underwater. I can clean them off. But you know, we're taking a look at this one. Uh, we're taking a look at the prototype H24, um, this 2008 model, and I think overall this is a this is a pretty decent uh, Hot Wheels uh, branded car, since this has no particular uh, real world manufacturer. Just again, this is like a prototype, a concept car, and I really do like the design on this. I mean, we have yeah, so as you can see, we got a nice uh, a nice curvaceous design there. No, it's a poor choice of words. Very very interesting wheel shaping. Uh, front wheel is smaller than the back wheel and like I guess technically the front wheel is normal sized and the back wheel is sort of over uh, oversized which usually I would complain about but um, j just because I like the, the overall design of this car it's um, I give it a pass really what gets points deducted for you is if you come out with something like uh, this uh, Mc literal McDonald's Happy Meal toy that has ridiculous looking tires since I guess this is what um, appealed to kids back in the day. So another thing I like about this design, I don't know what exactly these are. I guess the sort of the sort of split and uh, inset grills. I really like those, uh, especially how they're separate. It's, really, this grill design is frankly amazing. I don't know how else to say it. It's just it's just a really unique design and and it stands out um, in the collection. Um, the insides are very small, a bit too small uh, for my liking, but it really didn't check from, from the build since it, it's, a, it's really a sort of barely noticeable thing. It only really bothers you if you pay attention to it, but I mean, overall, the, the, uh, the body of the car uh, steals the show and in a great way, just sort of the main focus there. And I'm not entirely sure what this thing on the back is supposed to be. I'm, I'm not sure if that's supposed to be a tire. Um, like how they're sort of down to the side. I mean, in terms they could be up above, but I guess technically they put them down at the bottom because these would work if you placed them at the top. Very interesting car, very interesting design there. Um, I really do like what they did with this. And I think last year I was, I was set to record a, a review about uh, the prototype H24 vehicles that I had, but never got around to doing it since uh, diecast reviews went on a hiatus, but they're back now. So I consider that a win. So yeah, that'll basically wrap up this review to 2008 model. Um, I do have another permutation of this vehicle, but the only thing different is the colors. So I guess I'll also be reviewing that too, since the colors really do sort of make the vehicle look substantially different in my eyes i know they be, i know it may, it's, it's, it's the same body to some people but i think it's worth giving the other one a review since it, it, it just has a sort of different uh different aesthetic to it that was a pretty far fall i was not expecting that